In this video, I'd like to share with you one of the most important Qigong exercises you can practice. Hi, I'm Jeff Chan, acupuncturist, practitioner of traditional Chinese medicine and Qigong instructor. Whether you're a complete beginner to Qigong practice or you have some experience, this one exercise can be a very, very useful and helpful exercise. You can practice it basically anywhere. It's very simple. It's very easy. Now, the idea with Qigong practice is that we want to get the Qi moving throughout the body. We do that by lightly moving, breathing deeply, getting to the body to open up and relax. We have Qi that's flowing through the internal organs and all the meridians and the soft tissue in the body. And when it gets stuck and stagnant, then we get sick, we get ill, we don't feel our best. So Qigong practice, simply, you just get all the Qi moving everywhere in the body, and that way your immune system is healthy, your digestion's good, your energy level's good, you sleep well, you feel good, and you're happy. So this one exercise is almost like a superfood. So superfoods are foods that have all the carbohydrates, proteins, fats, nutrients, micronutrients that you can ever need. You eat that one superfood and it can fuel your body. So this one exercise is like that. It's like a superfood of Qigong. It's like a super Qigong kind of movement. So it's very simple. I'm sure you've even seen it before. So I'll show it to you and then we'll go through a little bit of a simple exercise. So what it's called is the opening exercise opening exercise looks like this. So you stand very comfortably, knees are slightly bent, arms are relaxed at the side, breathing in as the hands come up and around, breathing out as the hands come down to center. Breathing in, hands coming up and around, breathing out, hands coming down to center. And that's it. Breathing in and out. You could breathe in through the nose and out through the mouth. And as your body starts to relax, you can breathe in through the nose and out through the nose. The reason the opening exercise is so helpful is because it helps circulate the chi throughout all the internal organs and all the different systems. So if you have problems with tension, this is going to help the liver. If you have problems with, the, with any kind of breathing issues and allergies and respiration, this is going to help the lungs. If you have problems with digestion and appetite and poor digestion and, and other issues relating to digestion, this is going to help the spleen and stomach. If you have problems with sleep and hormones and uh, back pain and low energy, this is going to help the kidneys. So this one exercise really can help everything. Now, it's not the only Qigong exercise that you need for full health. But this is definitely one that you can choose to do if you don't have much time, you don't have much space, and you're just looking for a quick practice. Just practice the opening exercise for five minutes or so. So if you're all ready to begin, we can just do a few minutes of just practicing the opening exercise. So if you want, you can stand up, you can sit if you're comfortable with that, and just go through the movements. And just that's all we're going to do is just the opening exercise. So just stand comfortably with your feet flat on the ground. Just move your body around, wiggle around a little bit. Try to feel as if your body is going all the way through your feet into the ground. Feel like you're rooted like these, these ancient old growth trees around me here. Feel like you're really deep, deeply rooted and connected with the earth. Just take a few moments to just center yourself. Good, now let's begin the opening exercise. Breathing in as your hands come up and around. Breathing out as the hands come down the center. Breathing in and out. So breathing in, straightening your legs. Don't lock your legs, but straightening up, breathing out sinking your weight down, bending your weight slightly, sinking into the ground. Breathing in and out, sinking down. If you want to challenge yourself, you can take a wider stance. Breathing in, breathing out, sinking down even further. 
This helps build more chi. It helps warm up the system, warm up the legs, strengthen the legs, strengthen the knees and calves. Breathing in, as you're breathing in, imagine you're taking in good, vital, healthy, vibrant energy into your body. And as you're breathing out, imagine you're letting go of any tension, any worries, any stress. Breathing in. Qigong practices about what you do with your body, what you do with your breath. And what you do with your mind. So your intention and your thoughts are very important as you're practicing Qigong. So for the last few repetitions here, have a nice, simple, healthy, affirmative phrase in your mind that you can repeat. Breathing in, imagining that you're healthy, full of energy, full of life, your body's taking care of you, your mind is calm and clear, whatever phrase resonates. Breathing in, Three more on your own, repeating that phrase with every breath in. Last one, nice big vibrant breath, breathing in, taking in all the vitality, all the energy, calmness, peacefulness, serenity, breathing out, letting go of anything that's unnecessary. Hands back to your side. And you're all done. So you can practice that simple exercise once or even twice a day. If you do it for five minutes, great. If you can do it for 10 minutes, great. If you do it for one minute, that's fine. The opening exercise is wonderful to help just remind us that we can be healthy, we can be vibrant and full of life and energy. We just have to stop, breathe, let our body and our mind settle. Thanks so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this style of Qigong, please come join the community for a wide variety of Qigong routines that's ideal for beginners or if you already have some experience. The community has convenient, simple Qigong practices that are safe, gentle, and effective to help you feel healthy and full of vitality. Come join us today. If you haven't already, be sure to sign up for a newsletter in the link below so we can notify you when we release new YouTube videos. Thanks for watching and we'll see you soon.